St. James, it's my joy and privilege to introduce you to a family that's joining our church today, and that's the Barnes family. And I'm going to let Wes introduce them. Thank you. My name is Wes Barnes. This is my daughter, Virginia. This is my other daughter, Lillian Barnes, and my wife, Amy Barnes. Um, this is a very special day for us. Um, my oldest daughter, Virginia, has spent a lot of time in after-school programs here, and, and, and we've visited multiple times and, and feel like now is the time. Now is the time to transfer our membership from our legacy churches and become part of the St. James family. So th thank you all, and, and we look forward to seeing everyone very soon. Wonderful. Well, uh, for Amy and Wes, as I uh, receive you here, I'd like to ask just a couple questions. Uh, the first is, on behalf of the whole church, do you renounce the spiritual forces of wickedness, reject the evil powers of this world, and repent of your sin? If so say, I do. I do. I do. Cool. Do you accept the freedom and power God gives you to resist evil, injustice, and oppression in whatever forms they present themselves? If so, say, I do. I do. Do you confess Jesus Christ as your Savior, put your whole trust in his grace, and promise to serve him as, as your Lord in union with the church which Christ has opened to people of all ages, nations, and races? If so, say, I do. I do. Wonderful. And now I want to ask you, as we prepare to baptize Lillian, Will you nurture Lillian in Christ's holy church that by your teaching and example she may be guided to accept God's grace for herself, to profess her faith openly, and to lead a Christian life? If so, say, I will. I will. Wonderful. And Wes and Amy have a host of folks here with us, a host of six, uh, not too many. <laughs> uh, and I want to ask you all, as a representative of the body of Christ, Will you do all in your power to reaffirm your rejection of sin, your commitment to Christ, and nurture one another in the life of Christian faith and include this child before you in your care? If so, say, we will. We, we will. will. Yeah. Wonderful. And church, uh, I know you join in that as well. Let us pray. Eternal Father, when nothing existed but chaos, you swept across the dark waters and brought forth light. In the days of Noah, you saved those on the ark through water. After the flood, you set in the clouds a rainbow. When you saw your people as slaves in Egypt, you led them to freedom through the sea. Their children you brought through the Jordan to the land which you had promised. In the fullness of time, you sent Jesus, nurtured in the water of a womb. He was baptized by John, anointed by your spirit. He called his disciples to share in the baptism of his death and resurrection and to make disciples of all nations. Pour out your Holy Spirit on this water here, and she who receives it, to wash away her sin and clothe her in righteousness throughout her life, that dying and being raised with Christ, she may be raised in Christ's final victory. Amen. Lillian Sawyer, I baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, Holy Spirit. Amen. 